Hi guys, Ron Williams here, back again for another video on the channel, and back again for a match vlog. In this one then, it's Queen's Park Rangers at home at the Swansea.com Stadium for the boys today. It'll be an interesting game, look, on Wednesday night we had a point, I guess newly manager in charge, I should say new, I was going to say new promoted side, I don't know why, but Alex Neal in charge of Stoke, it was a point for them. Scored early on, conceded late, the usual, but it's City QPR, fantastic 3-1 win on Tuesday against Hull City, who are looking very, very good this season. QPR then, you know, they're looking really strong. Beat Watford a week prior to beating Hull City as well. So yeah, QPR scoring goals of fun recently. And of course, they've got former Jack Ethan Laird amongst their ranks now. So yeah, it will be a very, very challenging game. Chris Willock, Elias Chair, two of the best playmaking attack midfielders in the Championship. Really, really strong players. Lyndon Dykes can score goals as well. I've seen QPR miss an absolute sitter on Tuesday night. I don't know who missed it, but he literally missed an open goal, essentially. Hopefully, they can miss one of those today. But yeah, the Swans in. I'm pretty confident, considering we've only won one game this season, and still win us a home. Caban goes back from suspension, which is brilliant. Three potential new debuts as well, with the new signings coming in in the last week. Joel Pro back amongst the goals, 2-2 two two for him now, and he looked a lot, lot more livelier on him, up front by himself on Wednesday night. Obviously, Michael Obafemi still at the club, but, you know, I doubt he'll start today. Still question marks about Andy Fisher and Stephen Bender. Are they really good enough to be at this level? But yeah, I'm quietly confident today. I got a prediction later on in the video, but Saturday, 3 p.m. at the Swans.com Stadium. What is there not to love? Probably when we're 2 0 down inside seven minutes, but let's just try and stay positive until three o'clock. I'll see you guys later. Team's out, and it's a few big calls from Russell Martin. Change of goalkeeper Stephen Bender in goals today, then uh, Kyle Norton in the middle centre back with Wood and Cabango either side. Sernola on the right, Manning on the left, Allen and Grimes in midfield. Oli Cooper gets his second start of the season, so it's really good to see that. Patterson and Joel Pro. No Obafemi, no Encham on the bench. Um, Obafemi's probably had a strop or something, and Fumina is not going to move. Encham needs to be dropped, to be honest, because his work rate Wednesday was sackable. And um, yeah, Fisher dropped. Huge, huge call from Russell Martin. Let's hope it pays off QPR, as you expect. Chris Willock, Elias Chair, Lyndon Dykes all starting for the Yards. Uh, some fantastic players in there. So I'm really confident, to be honest. Happy with the lineup, some big calls. No darling either. He's on the bench. So yeah, Martin's not even trusting his former MK Dons players in this one. Two on swans. Be, co co be confident, why not? Scorers, Perot, Ollie Cooper, and Lyndon Dykes. So Muir Curtis we both went to Stoke win tonight where we saw Swan City unfortunately drop uh, points again. I know, I know. Uh, score prediction tonight then or today is coming to my well. Rangers. Queen's Park Rangers won 3 1 against Hull City. They took the absolute mick out of them, 3 0 at half time. Ethan Laird comes back as well. Yeah, scored as well. Yeah, I think I'm going to go for a 1 1 draw. Score us. Joe Poirot for us, and for QB, I'm going to go for Chris Willett goal. Yeah, fantastic player. Yeah. Cheers. Luke, Queen's Park Rangers home today. What's your score prediction for today, mate? Um, I think it's going to be a tough game. I think keeping our eyes inside, they've got some good players in there. After that Stoke performance, you know, I thought we played well, to be honest. Yeah, we, we did play in well, stages. but you know, they, they, they had a penalty shout towards the end. Um, they hit the bar in the first few minutes. Like, Which was a shock in from Fisher, who's been dropped. And yeah, but um, I'm going to go for Sony City nil, QBR 2. Um, Brilliant. I think Ethan Laird's guaranteed the score. And potentially. Then, Potentially, and uh, Chris Willock potentially as well. Yeah, cheers. cheers. So, Jake, QPR home today, score prediction? Uh, in the preview, I did say one all, but for some reason, since I got here, I'm just feeling confident and optimistic. The lineup's not great, but. I like it. Yeah, I I'm going to say Swansea City 2, Queen's Park Rangers 1. Ethan Laird, I think it's you know, swing all over for the score. Yeah. And I think, I think I'm right in saying it's the same goal scorer as you, Perro and Tony Cooper. Yeah, I said thanks on QPR. Ah, right. Not bad, cheers. Park Rangers. Come on, boys. Oh. <laughs> Here we go, another individual mistake from Nathan Wood. Him in the stakes, Chris Wallach. Good handling, Bender. Sornola. Go on, we want it back. Go on! Joel! Oh! Brilliant play from Matt Grimes. Perot turns, shoots, deflected. Unlucky. The bear of all. Onside! What is that? Sorry, Ola, what are you doing? Go! Go yourself. He tries to be unselfish, but it was a wrong decision. 
I saw him go in the game. I'll keep you set up really well so far, but nil nil. Manning. A ball! Cooper! Fred! Yes! Penalty! Get Penalty from the city. Brilliant ball at wide from Woods. Manning, lovely touch. Crosses are in. Joe Perot sneaking in there. There's a handball from the QPR player. Definitely handball. Uh, Shimmy's not been sent off, but a penalty. Perot. Come on, Joel. Scored uh, a penalty already this season. Let's hope we can do it again. He's potentially three and three games. Joel Perot. Save. Save. What a save, Sandy Dien. Oh, unlucky Joel. Good penalty, to be fair. Good save. Come on. Go on, Sornola! Go on! Yes! Come on! Get in there, Joel! Joel Piro, who needs penalties when you get a tap in? I was really worried for Piro when he missed that. But Conklin was the third of the season. He is back. He's a Swansea man. He's on fire. Brilliant work from Ollie Cooper. What a player as well. What now? Get in there. Ollie Cooper, fantastic as well. Come on. 1-0 Ollie Cooper Oh, corner Offside Good Way. Keeper's out Keeper's missed it Ball in Oh, unlucky Really, really good save from Stephen Bender. And that's why he's in goal. He makes saves, and that's what all the goalkeepers got to do. Right, corner ball. Ryan Manning to take. Deep one. Get it in. Oh! oh so close to a second. Matt Grimes off the line. Oh, brilliant ball from Manning. I'll set look a lot better this season. Come on, need that second to say that, but he still draw the game. Half time Swans 1 0 up then, home to QPR. Pretty solid half to be honest, they're not mucking around defensively. As soon as you know there's a bit of dangerous kicking out long, Pro obviously get on the score sheet yet again, which is brilliant to see for the season and the window has ended, so we'll be until January. Did miss a penalty though, but you know, players like that, when you get a bit of disappointment in front of court, the best thing to do is get back on the score sheet as soon as possible. He's done that. Yeah, really, really positive. Had that QPR, it's like dangerous for the current title life, she had a great chance which was safely saved by Bender. But yeah, we're looking a lot better, Ollie Cooper again working his socks off today. So far, so good, really, really enjoying it. And yeah, I said that about Stoke on Wednesday night and look what happened in the last minute. So hopefully, we can hold on to this one. So Kurt, half time 1 0, thoughts? Decent first half, very good first half. Joe Pro redeeming himself as well from the penalty miss save by Senny Dean. Very good save. Yeah, Elias Chess should have equalised the QPR. Yeah. But hopefully now, we can hold on for a change. <laughs> yeah, we don't hold on that often, do we? Yeah, Tyrus Campbell, 91st minute. Millwall scoring two in injury time. Oxford scoring in injury real. time to see us lose on penalties. Yeah. Four times a season. Just hope we can hold on for a change. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Cheers. So Luke, Queen's Park Rangers home yeah. today. What's your score prediction for today, mate? Um, I think it's going to be a tough game. I think we keep our Ivy's inside. We've got some good players in there. After that Stoke performance, you know, we've... I thought we played well, to be honest. Yeah, we, we did play in well, stages. but you know, they, they, they had a penalty shot towards the end. Um, they hit the bar in the first few minutes. Like, Which was a shock in from yeah. Fisher, who's been dropped. And yeah, but um, I'm going to go for Sony City nil, QBR 2. Um, Brilliant. I think Ethan Laird's guaranteed to score. And potentially. Then, potentially, and uh, Chris Willock potentially as well. Yeah, cheers. Sure. Jake, QBR home today, score prediction. Uh, in the preview, I did say one all, but for some reason, since I got here, I'm just feeling confident and optimistic. The lineup's not great, but I like it. Yeah, I, I'm gonna say Swansea City two, Queens Park Rangers one. Ethan Laird, I think it's you know just waiting all over for him to score. Yeah. And I think, I think I'm right in saying it's the same goal scorers as you, Perro and Tony Cooper. Yeah, I said Dykes on Cooper. Ah, right. Not bad, just. Oh no. Brilliant from Matthew. Yes! Oh, just wide. Keep the arcing forward. Out! Way! Oh, Ollie Cooper! Swanson! Rare! What a save! 
please don't concede. Uh, we keep uh, grown into this game, Massively saying half. We haven't had a kick in. Brilliant save, Ben Duff and Tyler Roberts. 22 minutes to go of normal time, so 1 0. You, you just got a feeling what is going to happen. I really hope it doesn't. Uh, keep it out playing well. Right, it looks like Ryan Manning will take his free kick to Swansea. Former Queen's Back Rangers player, of course. In the box! I've got Dean Sharfu from Wednesday. Bar me on me! Rush man, bar me on me! Rush man, bar me on me! Yes! Come on! Get in there! Come on! Full yeah. time! Swarm TCD1 Queen Light like Rangers, and we've won a game! Oh my god, I thought Deja Vu would not concede in the last minute. We've won a game at home. Oh, brilliant. Hopefully, this can just build a bit of momentum going forward because that was hard work playing. QPR was very, very good indeed. But what a win that was for us just to get a win at home. Still a bit of confidence. Cardiff losing as well with a Swans win. And the Blues lose. What is better than that? But yeah, what a performance. Seven of QPR fans are bloody terrific today, I must say that. But bloody hell, a penalty mess of what are you? We go pro scores. Bit, game just goes longer longer but yeah 1-0 win we'll have a smash in Saturday and yeah we won a bloody game of football couldn't believe it Swansea won QPR nil on to Birmingham next week brilliant see you later